I was sitting in a sub and I was thinking, this is big. This is absolutely mind blowing. The Neon region is a very special area in the Red Sea, which is already per se a special body of water. A sea that has a high rate of marine species that are only found in the Red Sea. It's really, really rich in geological and biological features that make it uh, quite distinct compared to the rest of the known biological features of the region. This expedition was to trying to capture how species are distributed and uh, how their um, actual ecology impacts their distribution from the shallow reefs to the mesophotic and deep reefs. It's something that has never been done before at this scale, especially in a tropical context. During this expedition, we've been able to really merge our traditional way of sampling with a new uh, way of sampling that is brought by the technology of Ocean X. You can see corals. There has been a lot of mesophotic reef exploration, deep reef exploration done by colleagues in the world, but nobody really had a chance to uh, deploy all these technological assets in the water at the same time to try and discover and tell a story. The most groundbreaking discovery from this expedition has been these very rich mesophotic communities that we've seen in the Gulf of Baca. It's gone beyond my hopes. This is new, this is not known, and we have the duty to report it and make it public and make sure that we preserve this, that this goes into management plans and, and, and conservation. There's going to be multiple students and colleagues that are going to benefit from this data. A great amount of information that we've collected that cannot be tackled by an individual. It's going to be multiple projects uh, that are going to unfold uh, both in the lab and again in the field somewhere else to compare the Neom area to other places in the Red Sea. Being able to witness this unfolding of life along the depth gradient is such a privilege, but it's also such a, an enlightenment moment. It's been a reconnection with this incredible push you have as a field scientist, as a marine scientist, to discover and describe and analyze and come up with new questions. It's been really refreshing. So I would say it's gone absolutely amazing, a thrilling six weeks for us.